Sundays, we are riding exotic superbikes on incredible racetracks somewhere far away. Some days we're not. <laughs> this, this is a not day, but I want to prove how much fun you can have with a 300 quid bike, a mate, and a backyard. So obviously, everything on motorbikes is more fun when you've got someone to do it with you. We've got two bikes here. I've actually got a guy who, it's kind of his fault that we're doing this, because he's, he's famous for doing a series called Cheap Bike Challenge. So, Sam Pilgrim, Sam, Absolute hey. pleasure. Yo, thanks mate. for having me. Hey guys, how you doing? So if you don't know Sam, the missing tooth kind of explains everything. He is an absolute lunatic on two wheels, legendary mountain biker, but you've done a series called Cheap Bike Challenge, which was about basically yeah. crap bikes. Well, it started with the free bike challenge because I actually saw one on the side of the road that said free <laughs> to a good home. Took that and done as many tricks as possible. And then that just got ridiculous and it ended up being like 50 episodes or whatever of just doing massive flips, tricks and all that on bikes that shouldn't be tricked, basically. So before we get cracking today, obviously we've tried to emulate here with the cheapest, nastiest motorbikes yeah. I could find. They're about 300 quid a piece, so not quite free, but cheap well, for motorbikes. Almost, yeah. Have you had any bikes that broke like and hurt you? Have you had any moments where oh, you were yeah. like- Oh yeah, we did actually have a few. Good, like I had a bamboo bike that snapped in half. So I just <laughs> face planted the tire. Uh, we bought one from Amazon. That snapped, the forks just snapped straight oh. off of it. Yeah, there's been a few good ones. Like all fairly lucky crashes, but yeah. they have broken quite badly. Yeah. Right, so the plan today is just to basically have a bit of challenge, a bit of head to head, okay. see how much fun we can have on these two. If we can get to lunchtime without breaking them, that'd be awesome. But after that, full send until one of them stops working. Sounds like a good challenge. This is a Suzuki EN125-2. It is, well, <laughs> I love a lot of Suzuki's. This is not Suzuki's finest work. It is a cheap, nasty 125 with bits hanging off of it. It has been previously crashed, not fast, probably too heavy, and I don't know how tough it's gonna be. We're gonna find out today. It's built for people to get around on, and that's the other end of the spectrum. From the fancy bikes we ride for fun, there are bikes like this that are just to get to work. But I reckon we can still put a smile on our faces for this. It's cheap, it's nasty, and the handlebars are at a funny angle. We're gonna send it and see what it'll do. And in the red, well, white corner, we have got this, the Honda CBF125. I reckon this might be the most Deliveroo, yodeled, commuted, couriered bike on the planet. Any city always seems to be full of these with a massive box on the back, running around, keeping the world moving which is a really nice way of saying they're cheap, they're economical, and they're easy to fix. This thing is gonna be great fun, and it, I don't reckon we can ever break it. Challenge accepted. <laughs> it worked. I got the most aerodynamic hand. Oh course. my God. <laughs> How are you supposed to That's ride with those? Horrible. <laughs> Uh-oh. We're well, off one already, that's the end. <laughs> After that particularly smooth start for the Suzuki, challenge one is hill climb challenge. So we've got a kind of off camber, slippery Welsh grass hillside. So you just want us to crash then basically. <laughs> basically, basically. And, and if we make it up, I'm just gonna make a shorter run up so, so that we're gonna crash. Ready then? Send it. Here we go. <laughs> Rubbish! <laughs> right, go on, let's beat that! Oh! Oh, I'm in the way! <laughs> that was so good! <laughs> Only just! Yes! One go each. I, I honestly didn't think we were even going to get off the, off the bottom of the yeah, hill yeah. there. I reckon best out of three. Okay. Best out of three attempts. So I've that's one nil to me. The more we can play on these, the better anyway, so. Exactly. Here we go, second go. Oh, same place, exactly. Get it. Whoa, the power comes on well quick. Oh, no! <laughs> oh, he's down! And he's firing mud everywhere! No way! 
That's one all. <laughs> yeah. It has been suggested by people who aren't riding motorbikes today <laughs> that we should try from the bottom and see if we can make it to the top. It's not their collarbones, but I'm game if you are. Let's try it, yeah. Are we going around the corner there or just from the... I think any anywhere you want, as okay, far I'm as you want. Okay, from the bottom then. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. So good coming That's up there. That's so sketchy. They just don't get into any sort of power band, do they? No, I changed the second and it went burr. <laughs> oh. I thought that was going well for a sec. That. It's still on. We proved that the hill's a challenge. Yeah. Next, I reckon we'll do, we'll embrace the complete lack of grip. I reckon the longest skid challenge. Perfect. Not down a hill though, right? <laughs> no, we'll end up back at your house. <laughs> Lock the brake there. Don't go off the end. Front wheel only. No. <laughs> I like how he thinks we might go off the end. This thing's not even going to pick up any speed anyway. It will probably be to there. Three, two, one, go. The slow pull away for the win. Ah, oh, it's gone horrendously wrong. <laughs> yeah. Sam, world, yes. world champion of skids. Oh. <laughs> right, what can I beat him at? What's next? I reckon pump track challenge. Timed challenge. Timed challenge on the pump track. Cool. I gotta say that looks sketchy. Yeah. Three, two. One, go! Woo! <laughs> Whoa! <Yeah. laughs> well good. Look at that, you cut a full right in and everything. That's sick, that bum, look. <laughs> That was pretty fast. <laughs> Three, two, one, go! <laughs> Glory! Yeah! <laughs> oh! Go on! Go on! Keep going! <laughs> nice! <laughs> <laughs> yeah! <laughs> right. Do you want to know your time now then? Uh, you did a 14.47. Oh, you did 19.13. Ah, <laughs> sucked. <laughs> wow. Smoked me. Easy, easy win. Well, <laughs> the weather's awesome. This is going to make the challenges more exciting, isn't it? <laughs> We're back at Enduro World again. I, one day I'm actually going to come here on an Enduro bike. But <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's much more fun to ride these. So Sam won the farm challenges, so I thought we'd come to Enduro Track and have a little bit of a play, see how many of these hard Enduro obstacles we can get up on definitely not hard Enduro bikes. So we've got massive hill climb, some skips, some tires, some ruts, some downhills, and some huge river crossings. So cool. But there's also a car park, and the most important thing is wheelies. Yeah. So I think first challenge here has got to be the wheelie challenge. Let's do it. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Yo, look how much broke. <laughs> oh. oh, Sam, I think you won the I'm highest wheelie. I did a proper 12 o'clock. Look at the bars as well. Wow, it literally obliterated. Let's get an action replay of that. <laughs> that was a high wheelie, we'll give you that. That's how I'm gonna have to ride now, because if I bend that back, it's gonna snap off. Mate, that was awesome. <laughs>
I don't know whether that counts as a win or a loss. I know we've done a hill climb challenge already, but we haven't done the hill climb challenge. If you ever come and ride at Enduro World, you have to ride the killer hill climb out the car park. It's the one that everyone can see you fail. And it's that monster over there, which on camera is going to look like nothing. We'll go and stand on it so you can see how horrendously steep it is. If you can't get over that little middle bit, you're actually going to die. And I will jump off this bike as soon as possible, so could be the end. Oh my God, you got so much air through that hole. I'll give it a go. I'm not really that excited about it. I think I'm going to go for a smoother option up there though. Dropping. Cool. Fair play. <laughs> if that was a smoother run up, we could probably go quite far. I wonder if there's a better run in. I'm up for another go. <laughs> Yo! <laughs> so close. Oh, I've got to get down again. This is the worst bit. <laughs> I reckon that's on. I did second gear here. You got to second. And then kicked it down on the hill. Oh, he's fast. Uh, it's the same step. It's so nice not caring about stuff. Right, I'm talking that as a win for the Suzuki. Yeah. By half a bike length. Yeah. <laughs> I think let's head out and find some extreme enduro tyre obstacles. Okay. Something yeah. horrible. Sounds good. So I reckon extreme enduro challenge next. This is like kind of little horrible extreme bit. Like, I don't think any extreme enduro is nice. It's all designed yeah, yeah. to be horrible. But we're going to go round over the rocks, through the tyre matrix, over these, which will be really grippy. Yeah, I They'll bet. be lovely. Yeah. And we, what are we saying? Who gets through? If we can do it, then who didn't put their feet down, I guess. There we are. We have to go over the rocks then. That's pretty death, isn't it? Cool, bottom out, that's not going to work. <laughs> this sucks. <laughs> oh, my bars <laughs> fell off. <laughs> oh, that looks horrible. Oh, it was almost oh, going to be horrible. there. <laughs> I reckon you've got it. I think if you hit it quick, it won't start to slide. Oh my God, it's so dangerous and he's slippy though, isn't it? That looks lethal. <laughs> he's through. Yes, sick. <laughs> the full commit wheelie. <laughs> <laughs> Straight down. <laughs> you won. <laughs> <laughs> you win just for the fact you got over that rock looking oh. like he knew what he was doing. It was well good. Dump the clutch, foot up. Yeah, that was well nice. Yeah, that looks, that looks more less, fun. Less horrendous. Less horrendous, but still Horrendous, really. Still not ideal. Still not Deliveroo, which yeah. is what these bikes are for. <laughs> no! Oh, that puddle, I thought I was going to go in that then. <laughs> oh. 
Nah. <laughs> Done. Look at this bar, like you can't do anything with it. What's the point? We've had a bit of rain. We're gonna finish off with some proper water. A nice swamp challenge. We always gotta do the swamp challenge last because there's a good chance we might just push the bikes over and not get them back out again. True, yeah, because if it's like actually as deep as it looks, then they might disappear. I got wet feet. I've got water in my engine. My bike doesn't work. Oh, I don't want to do that because then I've got to push it back. Yeah, it will help. It's too far away to help. <laughs> I'll save you. No way! <laughs> no! <laughs> Look at the handlebar! <laughs> <laughs> Did you like my approach to, to being on my knees? I like the dry foot approach. I'm dry! How? <laughs> Fair play. Oh, what a challenge. <laughs> I can't believe the Honda went through water that was seat deep. Yeah. <laughs> That's actually really impressive that it was underwater to there. That's unreal. So we've proven. Honda, everybody. Honda is the bike of choice if you're going underwater. Yeah. <laughs> not for anything else though in this challenge. No, it's not a trials bike. That's for sure, yeah. But as a submarine, faultless. <laughs> Mate, <laughs> that was awesome. Annoyingly, I think now we've cleared that airbox though, that might go. Oh, wow, no way. <laughs> That's insane, isn't You're it? not dead! Just literally was in the water for like five minutes and it's still <laughs> fully fine. drowned. And Crazy. now it even ticks over. The ultimate commuter bike. In, in all situations, it yeah. comes out. <laughs> right, next challenge. Let's have a race around this little moto track. Two laps? Yeah, and we're gonna have a running race to get to the bike. A Le Mans start. Yeah. Done. Right. Last challenge, winner takes all. Okay, cool. <laughs> two laps then. Yeah. Okay. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, come on. Oh my god, no it's so sketchy. Just don't crash through here. Oh no! Done it! 
my god. That's so sketchy. That was incredible. Them first few overtakes, Nat, was sick. <laughs> I got lost. I ran off the track into a ditch and ended up like in this drainage gully. Any excuse, eh? Ah, oh, there we are. Sam, mate, it's been an absolute yeah, pleasure. Thank you very much. That was awesome. Crap bikes are the best. If you want to see more, let us know. We'll yeah, do let us know. We'll do more some dumb stuff. So we are all done. It has been mega. I mean, there's been some needless destruction, <laughs> but that's what's fun. Motorbikes, we take so seriously so much of the time. Like, we're always on super expensive bikes in exotic places, and you have to be so careful and professional about stuff. This was such a good chance to just let our hair down and be dumbasses for a day. So uh, if you want to see more dumbass content, let us know in the comments, and we'll definitely do it because it has been hilarious. And no one died. Great success.